I'm Norma Alvarez. I'm an advocate. I'm a member of the Bailan Sasad who has organized this protest meet to protest against the atrocities and the violence which continues to take place in Manipur and particularly the atrocities against women. The Supreme Court has said that communities use violence against women as a way of sending a message to the other community that they are trying to supersede. And this is abominable, this is against the constitution and this should not take place at all. We are happy that the Supreme Court has appointed a commission of three Supreme Court judges, all of them women, retired High Court judges, to investigate the instant incident that took place from 4th of May onwards and still continues to some extent. And the Supreme Court has given a number of measures for providing relief, for speeding up the uh, uh, investigations into the FIRs and for ensuring that compensation is given to the victims and that the trials are brought to a conclusion. The Supreme Court has appointed its own officer, Mr. Sri Dattatre, to oversee the 42 special investigation teams which are appointed to investigate the 6,256 FIRs filed for violence and other crimes in Manipur. The, the Commission and Mr. Dattatre will report to the Supreme Court within eight weeks and the court will issue further directions after that. So, uh, what is your opinion and what is your demand that how government uh, should intervene or... There must be many more measures which should have been put into place earlier from May onwards to stop the violence. If the government wants, it can stop any violence within 24 hours. But to allow the two communities to fight against each other, to divide, to destroy, that is not proper at all. So now with the Supreme Court directions and with the government putting in some measures, we hope that peace will come to Manipur. But the rehabilitation of people, the broken homes, the damaged homes will take a long, long time to recover in Manipur. And that is very, very unfortunate.